In a customary move, the Yoon Sung Yeol administration on Monday announced a new round of pardons ahead of Liberation Day, which will also see around 800,000 administrative penalties on citizens also being lifted. Notably, Lee jung founder of Puyong Group and a key figure in introducing rental housing to South Korea, was included. Lee, who's already finished his sentence for embezzlement and tax evasion, still has a five-year employment restriction in effect, and the pardon will lift this. The pardons come into effect at midnight on Tuesday. Prime Minister Han Dok Su speaking at a cabinet meeting said the pardons highlighted the goal of boosting the economy despite challenging domestic and international circumstances, along with supporting the recovery of vulnerable members of society. He also took the opportunity to show gratitude to those involved in the World Sky Jamboree and emphasize the government's commitment to thoroughly analyzing how the event was handled.